season four of Yellowstone is set to return in June of this year. And anyone who watches Yellowstone knows that this is the most anticipated season yet. Season three left us with a cliffhanger, making folks jump out of their seats, wondering just what the future looked like for the members of the Dutton family. John Dutton was left for dead on the side of the road, suffering from multiple gunshot wounds from an unknown assailant. Casey used pure instinct to protect his life, tossing the table over in his office to protect himself from another large amount of gunfire brought on by another unknown assailant. And Beth was caught in an explosion that I'm not too sure anyone could survive after receiving a package from another unknown source to her work building, Schwartz and Meyer. The Duttons have their fair share of enemies, and in Season 3, we know that market equities were furious with the family. But many fans are not pointing the finger of blame to market equities. They're actually pointing blame towards another character. A character who carries the Dutton name, but not the Dutton blood. That character, of course, is Jamie. Fans are standing behind their theories that Jamie is the source for all of the violence that struck the Dutton family at the end of Season 3. And if you remember, Jamie figured out that he was adopted by John Dutton because his biological father was sentenced to prison after killing Jamie's mother. Of course, after Jamie learned of this, he went out looking for his father, and he ended up reconnecting with him, with his biological father, Garrett Randall and was given advice that may not be in Jamie's favor. Remember, Jamie's father suggested that violence was how you take care of the Duttons. Oh, and let's not forget the phone call between Jamie and Rip during all of this chaos. Rip resorted to calling Jamie after he was unable to reach John, Casey, and Beth to see if Jamie had any luck. Well, Jamie didn't have any luck because on the phone, he advised Rip that it would probably be best if he did not call him anymore. So needless to say, fans are furious with Jamie and are suggesting he is to blame for the hits against the Duttons. Here is the photo shared by Yellowstone to their official Instagram page that sparked this conversation with fans. You'll notice, similar to the ending of the show, Jamie was out in the field looking off into the distance, and of course these storm clouds overhead would suggest that there is uh, a storm cloud following Jamie uh, throughout the next chapter of this show. Many are suggesting he is to blame. It does look like that's how it would be. Um, and here is what Yellowstone put alongside with the photo. Yellowstone wrote, even the clouds around Jamie are ominous. And here are just a few of the comments in the enormous thread on this picture. You'll see here, fan wrote, Jamie, what have you done? Next, Jamie should have never looked for his real father. He is nothing but trouble. Third wrote, Jamie is up to nothing good. We continue to the next fan who wrote, he's not my favorite because I think he's the one that did it all. And lastly, you'll see here what that theory reads, Jamie needs to go with the uh, bullet hole emoji. So we could be seeing Jamie take a trip to the train station because Rip is not too pleased at this time, obviously. Now, we know Yellowstone is good for flipping the script on us and maybe not going the route that we would assume. One fan took it upon herself uh, to suggest this as well. Uh, she writes, it all looks too obvious that Jamie did it. So let's see who really done it. There could be other situations that would come to light in Season 4 that would allow us to know that maybe Jamie's not the cause for this as of yet. Um, but many would know that it probably was coming anyways if it ends up being Jamie. I mean, let's face it, the hell that he went through with Beth and now the fact that he's adopted, uh, he's probably not very pleased either. But Season 4 is right around the corner, folks, so hang in there. Uh, we'll be able to see all what went down uh, soon enough, even though I wish it was sooner than June. But it will be soon enough, folks. Season 4 is on its way. Let me know what you guys think, all these theories that you might have, anything that you want to discuss down below in the comments with Yellowstone. I'm all for it. Uh, like I said, best TV show we have had in a very long time. Guys, that will be it for today's video. Make sure you hit that subscribe button down below. Turn those notifications on as well so you never miss out on any breaking updates on your favorite country artist and all the news coming right out of Music City. Y'all stay country.